We say this in almost every destination we go to, but I think we found our new favorite city. <laughs> we love it here, and we've only been here for like three hours. Yeah, today was a travel day, but a short travel day, and we arrived from Sevilla to Cadiz. Uh, and check this out. for a few hours but we've already had tapas, gone to the beach, and seen a flamenco dancer. We've uh, we're done, we're good. Welcome to Cadiz. Welcome to Cadiz. Hi guys. Welcome to Cadi. Cadiz. Cadi. Cadiz. Cadiz. Anyways, we're here. <laughs> we're here. And it's warm and it's beautiful and it's beach town. It is. So what was your favorite thing this week? My favorite thing was a bike ride that we did. We rented some bikes and we rode around the town. Are we going to ride our bikes to the beach? Yeah. Yeah. Are okay. you ready to get in your seat? Yeah. Okay. The town isn't very big, so bikes are perfect. We packed our bags and went to the beach, had some towels and some snacks for Liesl, and we drove around. One thing that happened though was <laughs> I'm riding in front with Liesl and behind me on the little bike seat, and then all of a sudden I hear Ben. <laughs> I look back and she's like, my chain fell off. I went into handy handyman mode and that flipped, saved the day. Flipped the bike over, put the chain on, and then like two seconds later, it fell off again. So <laughs> we went through the whole process again. But then luckily, it worked out well. So. Yeah. We went to this little beach bar and it was great. Had some food. Lisa played in the sand. Yeah, we were there for maybe an hour, a couple hours, mm -hmm. and then we rode our bikes back along the promenade all the way around the city. So. Yeah, that was beautiful. Kelly, what was your favorite thing? My favorite thing was the flamenco show that we went to. Mm -hmm. So we don't have a ton of footage because they wouldn't allow us to film with our cameras, but they would allow us to take photos inside the flamenco show. Mm -hmm. um, we had tried to go to a flamenco show in Sevilla, but we kind of bombed it every single time because it was late and it was just hard to coordinate with Liesl being tired. But we actually managed to time our naps perfectly on our last night in Cadiz and it was cool and the dancers were awesome and the guitarist was amazing um, and it was the singer, just, the singer was awesome. The singer was awesome. It was great. Time for your favorite segment, the P C P. Oh my gosh! That's scary. You're scary. You just scared everybody away. Can you crop that? Everybody, out? everybody just clicked off. So if you're still with us, I'm just gonna go now. Just kidding. I'm back. Okay. Anyways, here's the P C B. The P C B. One pro, one con, one budget tip. So a pro is that it is super walkable. Cadiz is a pretty small town and we were able to explore it on foot multiple times. Um, it's also super flat, which is nice. So we did a lot of walking over a few days, but um, it's all easy walking. Yeah, lots of cobblestones, narrow alleys, just like what we had in Sevilla. Um, but it's kind of cool everybody is walking around the flip flops because it's a beach town. It's a beach town. Uh, What's the con? The con is that because it's a beach town and a very quaint old city, 
it is a little bit more touristic than we would have liked. They do get cruise ships once in a while, and lots of people are walking around, um, lots of foreigners. It didn't feel as authentic as Sevilla, even though Sevilla is a bigger city and also gets tourists. Sevilla just felt a little bit more true Spanish, like authenticity. Mm -hmm. well, so it's a little bit of a trade-off, you know? So you have this cool Spanish culture and it's still there, it's really alive, but it's also a little bit more touristic and you get people on cruise ships. So that drives prices up and maybe the quality of the food down a little bit. But I mean, comparative to any other places, the food was still really great, but we had just come yeah. from Sevilla, which was unbelievable. It's like, what's our budget tip? Our budget tip is save some money by going to the beach. Yep, the beach is free. You can walk to it, and it's fun for everyone. It's a playground for kids, playground for adults. Liesl met some friends playing on the beach, and they shared their beach toys. We watched yeah. the sunset one night, which was awesome. We saved a bunch of money in that regard. We didn't have any big excursions to do. We just kicked yeah. back and sat there on the towel and enjoyed the beach. Yeah. Okay guys, that is pretty much our wrap up of Cadiz. Thank you so much to those of you that have stuck with us and watched us throughout this whole journey. And we can't wait to share more of our experiences. Adios. Hasta luego. Hasta la vista, baby. <laughs> <laughs> okay, high five. Ooh. Hasta la vista, baby. Jeez, are you Terminator? I am the, the Schwarzenegger. The what? <laughs> The Terminator. <laughs> you won't be back. <laughs> I'll be back.